Hello and welcome to all learners to our new certification program related to virtualization. During the whole session or during the whole training program, we're gonna talk about virtualization, which is almost a decade older technology, but due to its tremendous benefits, is still meaningful for today IT world and is still relevant in building software defined networks or you can say sdn and cloud technologies so let's get the real concept of this technology during the whole training program we go through number of video sessions discussions practical exercises and assessments we will look at the future of virtualization and this uh, technology importance related to the current IT world. But before going to understand this technology, we just want to discuss the current uh, traditional infrastructure which we are using uh, before virtualization technology. Here you can see that we have three number of rigs in which we implemented number of servers. And when we talk about the physical servers, physical servers have three major components. Number one is called compute, which include motherboard, power supply, and other accessories. While the second and most important component is called is storage, which includes your SAS drives or SSD or SATA drives, uh, in which you can store your all kinds of data. And the last and other major component is called networking, which include your physical switches and your network adapters, which we are using for the purpose of connectivity, communication, resource sharing. For a while, you consider yourself a consultant and uh, by Monday morning, you get call from your um, valuable client and their IT spokesperson told you that one of their server is getting faulty and not operational. So you visit their data center and find out and diagnose that their motherboard is getting faulty. So in that situation, what is the solution? You definitely uh, you have to replace the motherboard. So for that purpose, you contact to the vendor and vendor said that, sorry, we don't have this specific motherboard available in our store because this is too older technology. And you know that uh, your client uh, using this server from last uh, 10 years or uh, for a single decade. So due to the older technology now this motherboard is totally disappear from the market so uh, in 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 this situation uh, your whole it operation will be uh, totally disturbed and you find out uh, that the solution for this problem is uh, you have to buy the new machine you have inserted your uh, storage media into that machine and each and everything will be working fine but unfortunately when you implement your uh, SAS drives or your SATA drives into the new server due to incompatibility your operating system will be buzzing freaking or you can say they're all applications and operating system components will be mess up with each other so uh, it is the it is the single incident which occur in a smaller environment what uh, if if we if we consider about the enterprise networks here you can see in other example let me clear with an other example here you can see that if we have an enterprise type of data center and within a single day this type of three to four or five incidents occur so you know that our IT operations will be uh, totally a nightmare for our clients here so due to due to this nightmare or due to this uh, major issue uh, your IT operations uh, will be totally uh, disturbed or will be totally uh, in, uh, in, in kind of threat for all the time 
because why it happens because your operating system is completely dependent on your hardware so due to which if any one of component is uh, uh, got failed from the physical infrastructure so you will be in trouble and your your whole uh, your number of clients will have numerous business losses here you can see that due to this hardware failure you will be face number of business losses in the industry and your whole infrastructure or your data center will be masked up and your client will be in a frustrated situation like this image they have uh, a number of uh, issues related to their performance related to their security related to their high availability and reliability so there are number of other uh, issues with this traditional infrastructure but the fundamental concept was that your operating system is completely dependent on the hardware so in that situation the industry experts analyzed the problem and uh, they are uh, they started working for a solution which comes up in the form of virtualization so let's uh, get uh, intro with this technology in our upcoming session